Well, Shelby County commissioners got a chance to hear results of a study on juvenile court. There are some concerns. Shelby County transfers more juveniles to adult courts than any other city in the state. Currently, there are 23 people under the age of 18 at Shelby County Jail South. As Local 24 News reporter Mike Matthews reports, commissioners want answers before spending a lot of money on a new facility. Juvenile Court in Memphis and Shelby County. It's been controversial for years. It remains that way. Shelby County commissioners heard the final report on the juvenile court system from a Department of Justice monitor. The DOJ decided to stop monitoring the facility late last year. But those that monitor say there were a lot of problems still remaining. One of the biggest things that they told us is that the way representation of juveniles um, that are arrested is chosen, the way that the, the, their lawyers are chosen, is suspect. Uh, I don't know if that's true, and there are there, reasonable people can disagree. County commissioners were told, again according to the report done by the DOJ monitor, that Shelby County transfers a lot of juvenile cases to adult court. More than Nashville or Knoxville or Chattanooga. A lot more as a matter of fact. Right now, example, there are 23 juveniles serving time in a segregated wing of the adult Jail East facility. They've been charged with some serious stuff. You can take a look at what those crimes are um, and the serious nature of those crimes. I'll just flag for you that we're talking about very serious violent felonies, including some sexual assault issues. So as you page through it, I just don't want you to be um, surprised by that. And this is why juvenile justice isn't easy. Adult crimes committed by kids. It hits me every day. The biggest concern for me is I see young men, young women come in. Uh, we have conversations with their children. They made an adult mistake or made a mistake that they should have made and ended up in this situation. But when you begin to have conversations with them, they're typical children, 14, 15, 16, 17 years of age. This county commission is very involved in this case. Many members want answers and they want them quickly before a whole lot of money is spent on this project. In Memphis, Mike Matthews, Local 24 News.